Absolute Wealth. Real investors, real results. Hey everybody, this is John. A uh, very good play yesterday in Apple. We did this in the trading room where we bought puts on Apple. It gapped down. Uh, no, we actually did it here. Sorry. We did it there. Yesterday's close. Gap down today. We closed out those puts. And now the question is, is what happens for tomorrow? Well, there's two plays here that I like. One play that we added today is we bought the $500 uh, butterfly. Uh, we did that in the room, and let me see. I'll just set it up here so you guys can see it. Uh, so on this trade, what we're looking at is that Apple, I did a 100, 200, 100, uh, that Apple can make its way back up to 500. Now, if it pins at $500 for monthly expiration, that would be the best, uh, best thing that could happen. So what I like about this trade is that, yeah, it's a low probability that it's going to close right at $500, but what you can do is you can see the um, risk reward here, which is pretty sweet. So you come over, oops, let me just bring this down a little bit. Okay, so what you do is you're just gonna go, you're gonna buy and then you just go to butterfly. You don't want to sell a butterfly. You're going to buy a butterfly because what, what what that means is you're buying the wings and then you're selling the $500 strike. So you can see this. You can get this for a 47 cent debit, and then you just hit uh, this confirm and send, and now you can see the risk reward ratio. So what this means is that on my account, my max loss is $4,700, and my max profit is $45,300. These options expire Friday. So how I get my max profit is if Apple actually pins at $500. Well, that's, you know, unlikely event, but it's possible. Uh, but it could actually get close to $500 too. So how this risk graph works is it just shows you, I mean, it shows you two things. And that if, here's the price, so here's the price right now, 486.04. And then it'll also show you um, say, you know, where your PL would be, like if you're at 500. Well, the white line shows you what your PL will be right now. The red line shows you what it'll be at expiration. So if we're at $500 at expiration, you can see that that's where we'll get that max profit of, you know, 40 some odd thousand dollars. Uh, in the meantime, though, you can see that you can kind of see where it'll, the prices will show up right here. So, so you can see right now, I'm up $22.41 and my max loss is $4,300. If tomorrow we jump up to $500, I'll be up $2,280. But remember, at that point, there's still gonna be a lot of premiums. We've got to get all the way to expiration to really milk that premium erosion and get that max profit of you know, $45,000, $46,000. So anyway, that'll be, and, and as uh, each with each passing day, this white part will start matching more and more what the expiration curve looks like. So anyway, that's kind of the range that we have. And um, you know, like I said, if Apple, uh, gaps down tomorrow, great. I'd be buying and looking for Apple to start working its way back to 500 for options expiration. Okay, hope that helps. You guys have a great night, and we'll see you at the next update.